In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the area model with the diamond problem. So, first, um, you have uh, this quadratic expression, and we're going to factor this quadratic expression. So, I'm first going to uh, get the 2x squared, put it down here, and then the plus 3, put here, plus 3. Um, next thing, um, down here, I'm going to use the, the diamond. You see the 5x? I'm going to put the 5x down here. And um, now, the product, I'm going to uh, multiply these two numbers, the 2x squared and the 3. 2x squared times 3 is 6x squared. Right. Um, we did this before when we looked at the problem that involved um, a character named Casey. This is Casey's pattern um, when we when we multiply the the diagonals, right? Um, so now um, this is the part where you have to think, right? You have to try to come up with these two numbers here and here, right? So you ask yourself, what two numbers can I multiply? and I'll get 6x squared and if I add them I will get um, 5x so the numbers that come to mind think about it for a minute the numbers that come to mind are 2x and 3x right 2x plus 3x is 5x squared and 2x times 3x is 6x squared. So I'm going to place the 2x here and the 3x. And these two placements of the 2x and the 3x are interchangeable. I could have placed the 3x in the place of the 2x and vice versa. All right, now that you have um, this area model set up, the next thing you have to think about is coming up with uh, these values. Right, and we have done this already. So I'll try to come up with these two values first. So what two numbers can I multiply? That'll give me 2x squared. Um, what comes to mind is 2x and 1x. 2x times 1x is 2x squared. And now I'm gonna to try to come up with this number, right? I have to ask myself, what this number times this number has to give me 2x. So that leaves this number to be 1, right? 2x times 1 is 2x. And the last part, the last number, this one over here, I, I, I ask myself, this number times this number should give me 3x. So that leaves this number to be 3, right? Because 1x times 3 is 3x. So now that I have um, the outside numbers for this area model, I can now write the factors, which are 2x plus 3, which I'm getting from right here, times 1x plus 1, which I'm getting from right here. So these are the factors of this quadratic expression. 2x squared plus 5x plus 3. And this is how you use an area model with a diamond problem.